Live in the morning buzz. It is 704, Randy and Sarah. All right, we've got a concert announcement uh, to pass along to you. Major. Major concert announcement. Mm -hmm. It's Lee Bryce. Yay! Hey, everybody's favorite, I'll tell you. Drinking he's class. Guy coming guy. in concert to the main mm -hmm. state pier in Portland. Wow. And he's going to be there on uh, Saturday, May 16th. That's right around the corner. It is. Mm. So we've got a chance for you to uh, win tickets. We're going to give you a chance to win a pair this morning here on the Morning mm -hmm. Buzz. And you can also go to our contest page at b985.fm. And uh, you can uh, share entries and things like that to win a pair of tickets yep. to see Lee Bryce. So we'll make the drawing for those on the Bistro on Friday. Yes, absolutely. But uh, Lee Bryce is coming in concert. Lee Bryce. And it's right around the corner on May 16th. So keep listening this morning here on the Morning Buzz. And we'll give you your chance to win the, the first pair of tickets that mm -hmm. we have to give away. All right, now we've got some special guests in our studio. We do. From Down East Dickering. Hey. We have. <laughs> I'm excited. We have the Morin Twins, uh, Tim and Greg, and we have Bruce Thomas. Good morning, guys. It's good to have hey. you in with us this morning. How you all what? going? Not all at once. Take your time. Good morning. 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 Be like the three students. Hello. Like hello. Hello. <laughs> hello. Hello. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> okay. Well, you guys so. What's that? What's that all about? Uh, now, you guys, uh, let, Bruce seems to be the one to talk a little bit. Get a little closer to the mic there. He's our Bruce. chatty Kathy. Because Bruce yeah. has been on a lot. Because I'll have to fight these guys over this. Yeah. yeah. As soon as they get over there, uh, they're being shy. They'll, uh, they'll, be they'll, they'll start talking. Oh, yeah. yeah. They do get over their shyness. But, Bruce, you were on a lot of shows at Downey's Dickering, and the unfortunate thing is you guys are in today because Downey's Dickering it has been canceled. Oh, man. Sure. It that canceled it. Better yeah, now, better yeah, now Duck than Yeah, Dynasty we and the Crocagator people are still around. I, never I don't know, that. those those Crocagator hunters that yeah, need... Yeah, the Crocodile hunters that, from that Louisiana. Need, Swamp that need, people. Oh. Swamp people, that yeah. That need subtitles in order for you to watch it. I mean, yeah, you guys don't they, need subtitles. No, we don't need subtitles. That's the cool part. Down south, you have to have subtitles. They do. Maybe, do. maybe we need subtitles in Louisiana, though. Uh, yeah, you maybe, might. perhaps. You might. Yeah. That's very true. That's very true. <laughs> but uh, they, the, the, the Donnie's Dickering was canceled. How many how many seasons did it go? We did two seasons. Two seasons. I, I noticed one thing, though. The Morn Brothers came on, and we got canceled. I know. Oh, what happened? You know, Greg that? and I were talking about that, and as much as history tried to save the show, even Greg and I couldn't do it. <laughs> <laughs> Wow, I see uh, one one look at the, another look yeah. at, the, the, at that uh, situation oh, goodness there. Goodness gracious. Uh, Tim and Greg, you guys got to be on, what, like two shows, and then that was basically it. What were the shows that you were on? What, what were, were some of the dickering things that you guys did on the shows? We did the uh, kayak limousine uh, where we uh, dickered a deal for some limousines. Oh, yeah, okay. And uh, turned it into a kayak-carrying promotional vehicle for our business. Gotcha. And uh, we also did the Dickering Days episode where... Uh, I think this is why Bruce might be a little sour towards you guys. Oh, what, what do you mean? <laughs> <laughs> no defensiveness there. Oh, yeah. Yeah, where where uh, the, the block and tackle did make its way around. <laughs> it did. It sure oh, did. Oh, I remember that. Yes, remember, that yes, block and tackle yes. thing. Oh, that was so funny. A sold so it funny. to B, and B sold it to C, and C sold it right back to B. And, and it, was, it went right yeah. back around in a circle. Yeah, that was mm -hmm. so funny. But uh, what was the reason that they gave? Now, you got a call, actually, Bruce. Well, you were in a lot of shows, though. I mean, you were in quite a few. How many were you in? What? Well, I just, that's the second time you said that. I think you're r rubbing a little salt in the water. No, 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 no. Come on, brother. Come on, no. guys. You, because well, you, you I'll, started. I'll you you know, Bruce is part of the original cast. Yeah, he started from the very first. That's I mean, it. from the very and, beginning. And it that's makes what sense means. coming into the second season that they would have more of the original cast and more episodes. Absolutely. Yeah. Uh, Greg and I filmed four episodes, uh -huh. but all the other teams filmed extra episodes as well. Yeah. And they only yeah. had so many episodes. So they could only get so many had, on TV. Some of them had, some to, of them be had to be out, gone. Yeah, and it only made sense to cut out, you know, some of the new guys. The question yeah. is, though, did you still get paid for the filmed episodes, or did you only get paid for the Listen, ones that actually yeah. ran on TV? <laughs> you want to talk How did that about work? Money? We lost money. You know? this whole year. There was no money to be made. <laughs> Where was the dickering in that? Uh, I thought really it wasn't was. about that. Uh, you know, it was kind of about the experience. Well, and sure, promoting our business. You know? Yeah, yeah. That's right. Not a bad thing. And I'll tell you, we went to Fort Kent last week, and people recognized. Oh, well, see, that's good. And that's what, Bruce, you were saying, that you get recognized all over the place now, too. Your your anonymity is pretty much gone 
It does happen. My wife told me that I can't get away with anything anymore. Yeah. Like, <laughs> you he can sells never get his, away with anything with her anyway. He like. sells his hat all over the world. In fact, somebody took a picture of it in Japan. That's correct. Yes. That's correct. Yeah, I pay attention. Absolutely. What, the hat you have on right now? Well, that, that, one that. of them. These are for sale. These hats are for sale, by the way. $15 and $5 shipping. You go on my webpage. Oh, okay. Wait a minute now. And, you got to show that hat nice okay. and clear <laughs> to our <laughs> web camera there. <laughs> to our well, web camera. There well, we and then in that case, the shirt I'm wearing... <laughs> oh, there you go. I Love Guys Who Dicker is also available at where? Twin Dickering Apparel on the Tim and Greg Morn. <laughs> all right. All right. All right. They you brought guys... this for me as a gift. Nice. You, you are all shameless. Do I shameless. get a hat? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they brought it. They, they gave it to you as a gift and then they made you pay for it, right? No. No. no, no. <laughs> wow. That's amazing. We should all right. have. <laughs> Yeah, now, <laughs> hindsight, right? Yeah. We need the money. Right. <laughs> Tim and Greg Morin and uh, Bruce Thomas from Downey Snickering. Now, the show is canceled, but there is an event that's coming up, and we're going to talk about that coming yes. up in just a little bit. We're going to do our B Big Shot birthdays next.